Hi, my name is Dr. Eileen Kande. I'm the head dietitian at Sir HN Reliance Foundation Hospital. I'm here to wish one and all a happy Nutrition Month. This year, the theme for our National Nutrition Month is Nutrition for All, Affordable Nutrition for All. And I'm here to give you a few tips of how you can improve your nutrition. First of all, I'm very happy that the guidelines that the recommended dietary allowances 2023 has been recently released. And something that is very interesting in the guidelines is the requirement for nutrients for all our people, all Indians. Specifically, what attracted me was the guidelines that said about giving cereal pulses and milk as a combination to improve the protein index of the individuals. So whilst we talk about proteins and we talk about how you should be eating, it is something that we should realize that we have basic necessities in our own kitchens to provide adequate and enough proteins in our diet. If you look at the combinations that is recommended as per the RDA 2023, it is in the combination of cereal, legumes, and milk. That is CPM or CLM. Now, we all eat a lot of cereals in forms of millets or in forms of other grains. What is emphasized also this year is the National Nutrition uh, Week plus the International Year of the Millets. And I think where we talk about grains and cereals, millets form a very important role. Because millets are made up of so many different kinds of fibers and it also decreases the low glycemic index of the food. Now, com combining a millet with a legume or a pulse is a very healthy combination because that will give you a good quality protein. So in addition to having cereal pulses, you also can add dairy to increase the availability of proteins that your body can get. So doing uh, a combination like a cereal pulse milk, so like a khichdi curry and uh, dal would be a very good option. The other options that you need to choose is the fiber in your diet. So lots of fibers will come from eating good amount of vegetables, fruits. Uh, over and above, it is also important that we understand that the quantity of uh, uh, micronutrients that we are consuming, whether it be multivitamins, minerals, calcium, phosphorus, iron, magnesium. These are all uh, important um, micronutrients which are uh, need to be had in an adequate amount. Besides looking at the, what you can eat, there's another aspect which is very important for all of our health is to be active. Whilst being active, do some small kind of exercises, if, even if it is not a gym, if it is normal walking, yoga, and so many other activities which can be planned as per our schedules, and do some kind of physical activity which will help us to be healthier. Along with getting fit, we need to hydrate ourselves with, well. Hydration comes very easily. It's not only plain water that you can drink, but you can also have things like lime water, cocum water, buttermilk. These are all homemade, uh, easily available liquids that are easy for us to consume and hydrate well. The other important aspect, whilst we concentrate on Poshan Maha this year is sleep. We need to sleep adequately at a regular time, even if you're a late shift worker, a night worker, or in an extreme uh, working shift, see that you keep adequate amount of time for a good quality sleep. Whilst all this is said, we can still help you to form a good diet for yourself. If you need our assistance and if you need our help, please do come to HN Reliance Foundation Hospital and we will help you to individualize and personalize your diet. We are happy to help you. We thank you for listening and please have a very happy, happy National Nutrition Month.